All right, today we're going to discuss the Chinese vertical axis wind turbine. Are they worth it? Absolutely not. I paid $153 for this thing. I had to get the uh, buy the flange to mount it to my post. You can see the flange uh, like right there. That was 30 bucks. Then uh, it's got to connect to the 12 volt because it's AC so you have a controller like this right here and basically you can see the little green light on which means the controller is getting 12 volt the first one I bought didn't have directions to it so I just hooked it up and I ended up burning out the controller because you've got to hook up the 12 volt first to the controller then hook up the, uh, the turbine now that turbine is an AC turbine and what it does is this little box right here that uh, converts it over to DC 12 or 24 volts and then uh, it goes down below through my tower wiring and it goes down below but you can hook it to a controller down there to find out what it's doing so I had to buy an inline meter for 10 bucks so in uh, reality th this little guy right here uh, it was about 25 bucks. I burnt the first one out, so I had to buy another one. That's another 25 bucks. So I got about, I don't know, probably 250 in this thing. And uh, it has been running solidly for over a week. And has produced absolutely zero in power. Now that's my horizontal axis wind turbine. It's 330 watts. In the last few days, it's produced about 15 amp hours. Uh, it's a little higher than this one. But yesterday, we had really, really good wind coming in. And this thing was spinning like crazy. I went down below expecting to see, you know, some kind of results. Because the wind was blowing, I guarantee you, between probably 15 to 18 miles an hour through here. The horizontal axis wind turbine, this one up here, it's an old one. Probably had it about five years on my boat. Uh, it was just cranking out all 12, 13, 14 amps. This thing right here was producing absolutely nothing. Now, here's the story on this thing. I bought this on eBay. Supposed to be a 600 watt turbine. I get the unit. I start looking at it. Well, in the process of it coming here, I had done a little research on Alibaba site to uh, find out about these turbine motors and what size and things like that. So when I get this one, I'm comparing the size uh, and it doesn't stack up to the 600 watt. I've got the specs down below in my next video. I'll give you all the specs on the motors. But uh, it actually ended up uh, being a 400 watt turbine. And I also found that on the box, there's a little tag from the manufacturer it was mostly in Chinese, but there was a couple little numbers on there that I got on Google and tracked down the numbers. So it's supposed to be a 400 watt turbine. So I contacted the seller and basically said, this is not correct. And right now I'm in the process of getting my money back through eBay. Um, and a friend of mine bought the exact same turbine. <laughs> His bad, sad and bad luck was he dragged this thing from California where he works at. He actually lives here and in the Bahamas, got two boats. And, uh, but he works in California and he bought one and he dragged it through customs and all kind of stuff. Extra parts, all that stuff through customs in the Bahamas. Mounted it on the boat and it basically does nothing. So he is turning around and getting his money back on this unit too. So all I can tell you is this, it don't work. It, I'm talking it has produced absolutely zero power since I've had it. And I have rechecked my wiring. I even checked the meter and put it against my solar system. I have about a 600 watt solar system. I disconnected the meter off of this turbine, put it on my solar system, and it registers perfect. So there's nothing wrong with the meter. That controller right there is showing that it's 12 volt is lit up. It's got a little green light to the right of that uh, that flickers that basically says that it's putting out power. But guess what? It's putting out nothing. 
zero. Do not buy these things. They are junk. And most of them they're advertising for 600 watts. You're probably lucky if you get a 400 watt motor. And a lot of them they're advertising for 600 watts are 100 and 200 watt motors. They're little teeny pancakes. And like I said, my next video is going to be on the size of these things to basically tell you if you do have one, what you got. And I'm telling you, you're going to be depressed because it, this is really a bunch of bullshit. So stay away from these things. Don't buy them. Stay with the horizontal wind turbines. The only thing I can say about this is one thing. It is very quiet. It makes absolutely no noise whatsoever, even when it's turning at high speed. The horizontal wind turbine, <laughs> it'll, it'll wake the dead. It's woke me up many times at night, just, I mean, it cranks up. But that little guy right there does produce power. This one right here produces nothing. Stay away. Don't buy one. Say goodnight, Mel. Goodnight, Mel.